Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got a video comparing the new leaked Target Black Friday deals for gaming versus the ones that Best Buy just leaked. And most likely all of these will probably pr be price matched by Amazon. So be on the lookout for that on Black Friday or actually really they'll probably go on sale Thanksgiving, really. <laughs> but let's take a quick look here for Target. Um, Target has some really, really good stuff for gaming. Only a few things beat out Best Buys, but here are the ones to note. And I'll let you know, basically, what's a good deal, what's a bad deal, uh, which games or accessories are worth buying, etc. But first, we've got this awesome, awesome door buster right here. So if you're a fan of the 1UP Arcades, They've got the Pac-Man version or the Marvel superhero uh, version for $249. That is a great deal, especially for the Marvel superhero edition. That is definitely something that's probably going to be flying off the shelves. I looked, though, and you will be able to purchase online. So uh, you should be able to purchase online and get free shipping, if not just do a store pickup, because they're allowing you to do that. Now, moving on to the... $15 games right here. These are these are where the, the deals are going to beat Best Buy for these games. Best Buy has these, I believe, at 20 and we'll see that in a second. But a couple of games I really want to highlight that are super cheap, that are excellent. The uh, Nintendo Switch game, Killer Queen Black, that's a great deal because it's going to be a little more at Best Buy. Also, the Lion King Aladdin collection is on sale for 15 bucks for Switch or PS4, and I think Xbox One as well, but definitely Switch and PS4. That's a great deal because it's a little more in Best Buy. Resident Evil 2, phenomenal game, worth $15, definitely. I mean, that's a $60 game. It's worth $15. It's a great deal. Kingdom Hearts 3, another great deal, worth it. Mario vs. Rabbids, great deal. That's a great tactical uh, RPG type of game for the Nintendo Switch and the Crash Team Racing and Crash Collection for 15 bucks. Those are really, 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 really good deals. Moving over to the $25 games, you can expect Beck Spy to match these. They're going to be 25 bucks. Some highlights are Control, and I would say Spyro Collection is pretty good. Forza Horizon is really, really good, but that's it from this list right here. Uh, go to the door busters for the Nintendo Switch titles. They're going to match um, on Best Buy. So these are really good prices. All three of these games are great. Obviously, Zelda and Mario Odyssey, phenomenal games. The $30 games right here, right under it, not worth it, any of these, uh, because you're going to get them at a better deal at Best Buy. They're going to be $5 cheaper. Two to highlight here are Judgment and Catherine, phenomenal Full price games. They're going to be twenty five dollars for Best Buy. We'll take a look at that in a second. And over here, nothing worth it here because it's going to be five dollars. Actually, no, I think it's ten dollars cheaper on Best Buy. So especially Gears of War Five is going to be twenty five dollars. I believe we'll check down in a minute. This is a great deal. This is a promotion right here for the PS Four bundle for with three games, three of the best games on the PS Four for one ninety nine. That's going to be matched everywhere. GameStop, Amazon. Best Buy. Uh, the controllers are going to be matched as well. 40 bucks for the controllers for PS4 or Xbox One. And then a little bit of a sale, not much of a big sale for the Switch controllers. You're also getting uh, right here an Xbox One X with a Gears of War 5. I wouldn't get this one. I would get a different bundle because you can get Gears of War 5 at Best Buy for $25 and get a more expensive games with your Xbox One X because you're you're uh, spending $350. But the nice thing is you get a $40 gift card. So you could go with this. It's still a really good deal because you can just basically pick up another free game. Uh, and then this deal, I've seen this at Best Buy as well. This is well worth it. I own a PSVR. It's incredible. And you're getting some of the best games. You're getting five of the best PSVR games with the headset. It's so worth it. Switch Lite. 
not on sale, of course. <laughs> and that's all we have for Target. Now let's move over to Best Buy. Nothing really to note on this page right here. I'll link everything. I'll link the pages down below where you can uh, check this out. But yeah, so far nothing, 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 nothing. Yeah, you get a free. <laughs> Thanks, Nintendo. You get a free screen protector for when you purchase Switch at full price. This is really good though. Um, the Pokeball Plus is going to be twenty dollars. I believe it's going to be twenty dollars on Amazon as well, so you can pick it up there. And then right here, these Switch titles are actually cheaper. At Target, so you're saving. They didn't mention Splatoon 2, but I'd be watch out if Splatoon 2 is twenty nine dollars at Target. But Zelda Breath of the Wild, Mario Odyssey are twenty nine ninety nine instead of thirty nine ninety nine here. They're twenty nine ninety nine at Target, so worth it. A lot of these Switch games, if you have kids, are great. Uh, the Crash Bandicoot trilogy is great. The Lego games right here, they're all twenty dollars for the Switch. That's a really good deal. Bloodstained Ritual of the Night, phenomenal game. Worth it for 20 bucks. And Killer Queen Black... the Killer Queen Black is actually $5 cheaper at Target. So, so we talked about so you can get that there. Uh, yeah, if you want a case, whatever. No, 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 no. Octopath Traveler, that's a great price. That's worth it from this list. Uh, this is $5 cheaper at Target. And... Collection of my Hollow Knight is great. I think this is. I don't think the cart's on in here. By the way, I think it's just a download. But you might want to check out the price for that. I would get it digitally, not get this if it's not actual physical. Collection of Mono is a great deal for three incredibly uh, incredible games, which are classic classic games uh, from Super Nintendo and Game Boy. Uh, really great games. I highly recommend those. Ukulele. That's uh, and the Impossible Lair. I've I've heard great things about about this game. Actually, it's better than the original ukulele, and that's only twenty dollars for the Switch. That's actually a really great price. Dragon Ball Super, uh, Super Dragon Ball Heroes and Yu Gi Oh. Okay, yeah, but for twenty four and nineteen bucks. Okay, yeah. Uh, and then Pokemon Ultra Sun Ultra, Ultra Moon. That's actually a really good deal for those too. I don't think you're they're gonna can't beat those prices right there. Now we're going back. Uh, do not get this Switch dock. Only get the licensed Switch dock because all of these docks will brick your or have a chance of bricking your Switch. So don't take your chances on that. These accessories aren't really worth it for the price. This is a great deal. This is actually a really fun game. Starlink Battle of a a Atlas with the, the Star Fox thing right here. Um, it comes with the game and this ship that you can use within the game. It's really, really good game. I would totally get this, especially for only 10 bucks for the Switch. It's a great deal. And that's about it in this group of games that I would recommend. These are all really great. Uh, Nino Kuni for the Switch or PS4. I'm probably going to get this for the PS4, but this is still really cheap. $24. It's a great game. If you want it on the go, get it on the Switch. And then you got Final Fantasy uh, 12 and then 10 and 10 2. These are great prices for the Switch versions of them. The, these two that I just mentioned are going to be at Target for uh, $10, or actually $5 more, but you're saving $5 here. Each judgment and uh, Catherine. Oh, looks like my dog. Hi, buddy. Really quick puppy break for my buddy Joey. How you doing? A little Westy? All right. Boy. Okay. Um, what was I saying? Judgment, Catherine. Incredible games, great price for these two. Persona Q2 is a great deal here. And then Dragon Quest Builder is an okay game, but these three games, phenomenal deal here. I don't think you're going to beat that. And again, Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch for PS4 here. Uh, Undertale is a great game. for This is actually a physical version. It's a good deal for it. And Shining Resonance is a fun game for the Switch. I would totally get it for 25 bucks. But this is really great. Get the, get the Nino Cuny. And then here's the PS4 bundle right here. And actually these, you can actually get these. I think you can actually get the controllers and headsets now on sale at Best Buy. They're actually doing a pre-Black Friday deal. And then you get the new... This is actually a really good deal for brand new Call of Duty Modern Warfare for only 40 bucks now. It's already It just came out and it's already getting discounted on Black Friday. There's going to be plenty of copies of these. I'm sure Amazon's going to price match this stuff. 
And then the PS uh, VR bundle. Well worth it. You can get it here. Same price as Target. One thing I want to mention right here. This just came out. The remaster or remake of Medieval. 20 bucks. Go get it. Also, Days Gone, 20 bucks. This is a great game that got crapped on for no reason. And for $20, you can't go wrong. All of these PlayStation Hits titles, all of them are worth it. 10 bucks. All of these. Every single one of these games are incredible. Especially Bloodborne. Bloodborne's uh, my personal favorite. But all these. 10 bucks, can't beat it. Well, I don't know about Anthem. I don't know if Anthem's worth $10. But the Yakuza games are definitely worth it. And then uh, right here, we're seeing these are uh, price match. Actually, Mario vs. Rabbit, uh, Mario Rabbit's, uh, is it at Target? Is it cheaper at Target? Let's go back real quick. No, it's the same price. Okay, they're 15 bucks. So all these are 15 bucks, but these are the same deals that you have at Target as well. But you get Spider-Man here, the Game of the Year edition. This includes the DLC, which is a phenomenal deal for 15 bucks. That's awesome. That's awesome. And Division 2 is worth it. And Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Wow, Division 2 is only $15. That's a really great deal. I don't know if Ghost Recon Breakpoint's worth it, but it's the cheapest I've seen at Best Buy here. It's $27.99. If you're into that, go ahead and get it. Um, and then, obviously, Madden 2K, all the stuff like that right here. Borderlands 3 is only $27.99. This is a great deal for PS4. This is a great deal. Now you go down here. Rise of the Tomb Raider, Devil May Cry 5. Uh, all these games are really worth it for $15. They're really cheap here. Uh, Man, uh, Dark Pictures, Man of Medan. Let's see, Skyrim, Shenmue 1 and 2. All these are really, really good deal. I don't think you're going to beat these prices over here. These are the cheapest I've seen. Yakuza 6, definitely worth it. And then you go down to Forza Horizon 4. This is a great game. Dragon Quest, great game for $20. Bucks. Uh, Metro is a great game for $20. Bucks. And that's really about it here. Oh, and Mega Man 11 and Street Fighter 30th Anniversary. Definitely worth it for $16.99 each. Definitely worth it. Code Vein just came out and um, about a month ago, maybe a month and a half ago. It's already discounted at $40. Bucks. That's a pretty good price. Shenmue 3 is not even out yet, and it's already discounted at $34.99. That's a good deal. I hope. I hope it's a good game. And... Shadow of the Tomb Raider Definitive Edition is a really good price for $29.99. And then that's about it for here. And then here's a really, really good bundle, I think. Now, if you want to skip the $40 gift card at Target and you get Gears of War 5, you can get this Microsoft Xbox One X with Jedi Fallen Order and three months of uh, gold, which is pretty nice. So I would probably get this bundle, but... You know, the Target bundle's worth it, too. Uh, depends on what you want. I think you're getting a brand new game, though. Here is what I would argue. You'd get this with Jedi Fallen Order, which looks phenomenal. And then you can go, at Best Buy, purchase for $25, Gears of War 5. And all of these are really standard. This is actually a really good deal for the digital, $150. But this one for $200 with the NBA 2K is a pretty good deal. And that's about it. And then down here, we get Control is actually $5 more here. So you save $5 if you go to Best Buy and get it. Or excuse me, go to Target and get that. So you save, so don't get Control at Best Buy, get it at Target. And then you see down here, Red Dead Redemption 2, worth it, $24.99. Gears of War 5, that just came out, $24.99. Great deal. Great deal. Mortal Kombat 11, $25. And then Sekiro Shadows Died Twice, one of the best games I, that came out this year. $25, definitely jump on and get it. And then something worth it here, Concrete Genie, $19.99, and Ace Combat 7. Totally worth it, especially if you have a PSVR. These are great, great games. Other than that, anything else from this list? I really wouldn't. The Hitman 2 is really good, um, and that's about it. Skyrim VR, if you didn't get the VR headset I, uh, bundle. But definitely get that bundle and then get those two other VR games that we, I just talked about. And that's about it. That's about it from here. And that wraps it up for Best Buy versus Target. I think you're getting a lot more at Best Buy. But there's some really, really great deals you can take advantage of at Target. Like I said, the arcade one up and then a few games that are about $5 cheaper at Target. 
And then there's a few, there's a bunch more games at Best Buy that are five to ten dollars cheaper. So Amazon should be price matching at least Best Buy. I've seen that in the past. Hopefully they will. If they release their Black Friday, I'll do a follow up video. But thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe if you like this video. I'm going to be doing a holiday buyer's guide for Nintendo Switch, Xbox One, and PS4 in the coming weeks. Again, thank you so much for watching. Take care.